Okay, welcome back. Glad to have you back. All right, good. Here we are again. All right, so this time, I want to edit some of the settings. There's a lot of settings which can be toggled and accessed by the user and modified uh, to give uh, individual and, and specific inputs uh, to which the user would prefer in such a context. So that's what we're doing here. Now, there's not only league settings, but there's also player settings. And there's a lot of options, as you can see. It offers the sliders, um, not on the same scale as where you adjust it in terms of how severe uh, in the intensity, but more on uh, ratios, as in percents. So that's what you see here. All right, so this is the, 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 this, the page for the player settings. And most of this has to do with the draft talent and the structure, the distribution of the talent within the league. So I'm setting them uh, to that which I would prefer in such a context. But of course, there's going to be many players uh, of the game that would have other options that they select instead of this. Anyway, uh, persons who, to which are viewing this are um, welcome to, to select their own choices. But these are what I prefer in my context. Alright, now, so now I want to talk about, uh, the players yet again. The bench, I want to have a strong bench in this context. So I have Caesar Izuchus, who is much like Tun Fickens, Raphael Fercal. So there's a logicality, uh, a synthesis that makes sense, that appeals to our rationality, our mentalism. So that's one thing I want to highlight and emphasize. Now there's also Angel Barrow, Jason Rathko, both had some power and some speed. The ability to hit homers and steal beaches. Alright, now there's also Gibbons and Anderson, and they have strong arms uh, from the corner outfield spots. So that's good. I wanted to highlight that and emphasize that. Also, I want to make known that I believe upon Jesus Christ as the Lord and Savior, uh, that through him we can have salvation and liberation. So I just want to let my viewers know that so they are able to reflect upon that. Uh, in this context, I think it's relevant. M many people would, come, would say, assert that, okay, well, religion has nothing to do with baseball. Well, on the contrary, um, religion is underlying to all of our interactions and our chemistry. So that's one thing I want to put down before. Uh, uh, as well, I want to talk about the forum. There's a sports mogul forum for baseball mogul and any other products that they have so far on the market. And um, it's very easy to sign up. You just need your email. And then you create a passcode and you can start posting threads right away. Alright, now let's go back to the personality description for our manager, Quentin Caspian. Uh, or maybe he's the, the general manager. Now, I, he, in modern times, he can't really be both. Uh, so I was thinking, let's take a look at this. So, he smokes a pipe, has yellow skin, maybe some kind of uh, disease, chocolate cativa hair. Maybe his eyes glint like purple M&M's. Uh, perhaps he enjoys chewing on toothpicks that are minted with their flavor. And I don't know, maybe he even has several quirks, such as putting Percy syrup into his tacos. Alright, good. So we're done with all the stats from the prior year. Uh, it's kind of an idea of the baseball legacy and the the baseball history that I've been ensuing during this time period. Alex Rodriguez, uh, Magalio Ordonez, some of the best players from that prior year. Okay, so that's good. Now we're at the death chart, and you can see that it's mostly cosmetic. It doesn't offer all that any that many options to choose from or select. 
Now I want to talk about my style and these efforts with regard to PvP, which is play-by-play -play mode, where you go through each inning. Uh, you can either skip the inning or you can skip the batter. Uh, in such a context, I tend to be a bit meticulous or formulaic and appeal to clockwork. So with the lineups, the pitching, I'll try and find uh, a sense of order to which is logical and appeals to rationality or mentalism. Alright, good. So now we're taking a look at the sortable stats. There's a lot of options, as you can see, for both batting and pitching. Not only that, but there's also a draft talent pool of players you can select from. In this context, it's fictional rather than historical. I just tend to prefer uh, the fictional. It seems to be more realistic a lot of the time. So that's what I'm going to be using in this context. And, um, you know, a lot of the stats, they tend to be quite weird. That to which you would not expect. There's dis discrepancies and anomalies. Alright, good. Now we're going to go further on and take a look at the play menu, uh, cause you wanna get to opening day, um, where the season starts. And I don't think that's for at least another 20 days or so, about 30 at the very least. And it's really easy to toggle, you just sim. Uh, with the, when you click on the play button and you just select the choice, you can also choose the hockey option and um, that would also help you the the keyboard shortcut to do the same thing now I'm going to save it now I want to say all right good 